Here we go with the Udavella Sweden. Sweden Hassen Garden. Session information. She's blank, boys. She's blank, okay? What a fucking noob. You ever ride a bike before? Huh? Number 72? You ever fucking go off a berm like that shit? Lit it on fire! Fire! What the f Rewind that. Is this a track made for children and 50 cc's? Because look at this. You come up over this. What do you do if you have a 450? And it's like, hey, jump. Apex. Let's go. And there's nothing you can do. You look at Jump. 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 I'm off the ground here. I'm not even creating a mark on the ground. There's, there's just pure apex jump fuck off. That's kind of, kind of some bullshit. Let me have a retake at that. I'm going to take that at a different angle. But the fucking lies. The terrain lied to us. Look at that. There we go. Okay, so that's a right turn. Outside berm's a little uh, flat ewed. That off camber. Hmm. 80 foot table. Oh. That's kind of an interesting one. That's like super cross shit. Mm, that's gonna be a rhythm to conquer. Single inside line. Yeah, fuck that. Whoa! This is for sure gonna be a 250 track, man. Like, using 450s on this will be stupid fast, uncontrollable. Oh, two lines. Two lines. That's the first thing I noticed about that corner. 1 minute 32. Mm. Fuck! That is a hard section. It's supposed to be. How, do they, how are you going to do that on PlayStation? Shit don't even load 40 feet in front of you. Fuck. Shit looking like Excite Bike 64 on that console. Actually, both consoles. <laughs> I have to go with short gears for this track. Guaranteed guacamole. Oh, you fucking pussy. Oh, my God. Damn it. All right. Looks like uh, we're going to throw down a real heater this time. And while doing so, we'll just have a little infomercial about how this uh, track is going. It's a little technical, like this little drop here. You want to take that outside and then drop into it. It's it, Once you do it a few times, you get used to it. And it's actually not that bad. Uh, this is a mid-section turn here, like that. You're going to bring the front up. If you want to keep it in a wheelie, you can drop a nose over the top of that table. It'll actually throw you down pretty quickly and you'll save a lot of time. Uh, this here, do it however you want. I don't care. Do what you need to do. But yeah, this entire DLC package, including the two last tracks that I did a little short escapade on and review, is actually quite well developed. The berms are well done. The tracks are obviously from MXGP2, and some people don't like the fact that it's remade tracks and whatnot, but this is the MXGP series, and I'll, all I have to say is get the fuck used to it, because if a game was to be authentic, you don't want no bullshit tracks like you see on custom made ones for MX versus ATV like the, the, the physics in MX versus ATV are shit but on top of that the design of the tracks is also kind of crap so it's nice to have this kind of a DLC come out where the tracks are quite well designed like I said and you can actually do some good ripping on them look at this wheelie right here if you like the videos like and subscribe Leave a comment if you'd like to see something else, or leave your Steam name, I'll invite you to Discord, and you can come race with us. Peace!